Hey guys, it's me, Sonic X Rules, and I'm back with another video tutorial. But this time on Windows 8, it's my first video tutorial on Windows 8. And I have non toxic casual here with us on Skype. Hello, are you ah, there? Okay. <laughs> Guys, I'm on Windows 8, so I'll prove that I'm on Windows 8. To prove that I'm on Windows 8, I'm going to go to the Metro Start. You can see I have the charms and all, so it proves that I'm on Windows 8. So, if you guys are having difficulties trying to install Windows 7, Windows Vista video drivers on your Windows 8 copy, or trying to play Minecraft without video, without installing video drivers, that means WDDM 1.1 driver, which comes with. Windows 8, real tape. So you won't be able to play Minecraft or anything with that because there's no apps. We call it the OpenGL accelerator with it. It doesn't come with it. So today I'm going to show you how to install it. So when you first pop up the desktop, you get a nifty feature like that. Uh, guys, give me. Okay. It's just. It looks like it's a prank call. Who cares? Well, well, the first time when we load up the desktop. If you right click, like when you go to the right, bottom, left, left hand corner, you get the start pop up. But if you right click there, you get this list. So you can go to device manager here. So this should say some kind of something other like, right? and this is my card is also ZH3450. It means like it runs on the ATI radio on HD3450. So it was showing ATI radio on HD3450. So that's because it, it had the WDDM drive installed. Now I have this drive installed. So what you want to do is like you should get the drivers from the website, the Vista or the Windows 7 drivers. And I have mine. These are all my drivers that I need, Java. So I'm on Windows 8 x86 that is 32 bit. So uh, okay, back, back to the part. Yeah. So extract this. Like when you open this, you get this folder. You get these files. Put these files inside a folder. Okay, I've already put them inside a folder right here I've extracted it these are the files and so what you want to do is right now go to device manager just like this and go to your display driver settings display adapter sorry but good damn electrocuted <laughs> what happened I don't know something wrong with my plug okay let's continue with this right click on this go to properties then go to driver and it should say Microsoft Windows WDDM driver or something like that. So you should go to update driver. Browse my computer for driver software. Let me pick. Oh no, not not that. Okay, right here. Go to browse. Uh, like this. Go to your folder. Locate your folder that has a driver in it. Go to that folder. Expand it. Uh, go to packages expand that and w7 inf and okay on my drive it says this so go to packages and drivers and display so you get a folder like this click on that folder there might be a few folders you will have to figure out which one uh, so we'll continue with this You need the INF files, that means the configuration file, so it should say Windows 7 INF. That's what this stands for. So click next and it will search for the drivers. So it says that Windows has determined the driver software for your device. So it's up and it's up to date. So that's because I've already installed the driver. So when you first search it, you'll get a list. Don't click on that. Uh, you'll get a list like this. Give it some time. It's just installing drive software, but I didn't install anything. Okay, anyways, it should give you a list like that. It, it 
Richard say? Hello, can you see me? Okay, so if you know the software updated your drive software, you must... Is it still recording? Oh yes it is. However, like, I'll show you my INF file. So we went to packages, drivers, display, do seven INF. And excuse me. Right here. Okay. Like when you're inside this, uh, the setup will automatically choose the name. Uh, the name of the first one. So you should click on that and hit next. Then it'll give you a list. Like if it's if it tells you the correct name of your graphic card, that's the one you should install. If it doesn't, check the other INF file. That's how I got it to work. So guys, that's pretty much it. Then after installing, the window will flash, and you'll be good to go. You'll be able to play Minecraft just like I do. Uh, wait, I'll show you that I can play Minecraft. No, sorry for the lag, it's recording and all, so it lags like hell. Okay. Crack my <laughs> Hope you guys can see this. I'm not sure, but I can see this. So, see you guys. Excuse the lag, it's because of screen recorder. See. Loading in a ball. It's really, really slow because it's recording. Okay, guys, here it is. Sorry for the lag again, it's because it's recording. So, it, normally I get around 60 FPS on this. Hopefully you guys you will be able to see this. Yeah, you hear the song. So guys, that's pretty much it for this tutorial. If you guys ready in another video. I'm Toxic Cat, so we are going. Okay.